How you doing? Welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. And I wish that YouTube wouldn't be the one that gets to pick my screenshots, man, on my videos. Because, oh my god. Anyway, that's just, that's just me. And I'm burning some saves that just went out. Anyway, I just want to talk real quick about power. About energy vampires in particular. I just came across one. And there's a difference between wanting to help people, and wanting to be charitous and give of yourself. But then there's others who, who openly seek out people in need so they can purposely vamp off of them. They can energy, seriously, it's really scary. But you gotta be careful, because people are, because there's some shady people out there that'll say, hey, like especially, it's, it's almost like the, 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 the underage runaway kid at the, at the bus stop and some creepy dude comes by, you know what I mean? And try, I'll help you, that kind of thing. You know what I mean? That is a, exact, a great example of an energy vampire. There's something they want. This, this guy came by and was all, t and he looks sketchy. And he's like, uh, you know, you, you, you okay? You got food? You, got, you can see the fucking water in my vehicle, right? And I was like, he was basically casing my vehicle. And on top of that, when you talk about somebody in, the, in a, in a, in a position of weakness, that's the way they steal your power too. Do you understand? That's like I come up to you and say, oh, is there something I can help you with? That puts you in a position of weakness. Do you understand? Do you see how that exchange worked? They automatically put themselves in a position of authority over you. As if they were going to be the one that was protector. It gives, it gives them the boost and it gives you the... See what I'm saying? It's interesting how this works, but that's exactly how it is. Somebody comes up to you and they don't treat you as an equal. They don't say, how are you doing? How, you know, just, and you have a conversation. They're like, oh, don't, don't fall for the uh. Because some people, some people generally care. Old women, you're probably safe with, right? <laughs> They're like, oh, how can I help you? I mean, then again, you never know who a witch is, right? Good or bad, right? So you got to be careful. Everybody, you never know. It's like, it's like Bruce, it's like, what is it? It's, um, shit. I hate to use this reference because he's kind of in trouble right now. But Will Smith, when he shot that little cutout cardboard chick, you know, little girl with the, the physics books, right? It's like you just never know who the bad guy is. They can come in any form. So when somebody, and that dude actually tried to steal my power, and that's exactly why I'm making this video. Because when somebody tries, and that pissed me off, because I was like, dude, don't put me in a position of weakness in front of you because I'm not. I was like, I'm just here painting. I'm doing my thing, right? And I'm like, oh, by the way, the last painting that I posted sold a half hour after I did that. I was like, dude, I know this sucker's going to go on, dude. Anyway, yeah, on fire. So I'm sitting there painting, and this dude shows up, and you know what I mean? Interrupts my shit trying to talk about art, and then he starts asking me, like, oh. I'm like, no, 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 no. I'm working it. Get the fuck on, right? And then he uses Jesus, like, oh, Jesus loves you after I'm, like, already out, done with the conversation. Don't, don't throw Jesus in there, baby. You know, it's, it's a scam. Just like that preacher that's like, oh, you know, I want to help you. And then they touch you in the back, you know, go watch that shit. This is those Catholic motherfuckers, right? I'm just saying. I, I, like I said, I don't, I'm not a part of any major religion, so you can't. Yeah, I could talk some shit. But anyway, understand your power exchange. Understand when people try to put themselves above you, that's stealing your power. This self-love is important because as soon as you love yourself like I do, people are going to vamp. People are going to try to cut you down. Nobody wants to see me rise. Nobody wants to see me glow. Some people do, but a lot of people are haters, man. A lot of haters. I just got attacked by a whole bunch of gang stalking morons that hate. They're running on a hate. Man, that wasn't love. I wasn't getting, I wasn't feeling love from those assholes, right? So remember, when somebody tries it, oh, do you need something? Are you okay? That's a, that's a power exchange. And you guys said, no, I'm fine. Thank you. You have a nice day. You got to fucking be firm. You're the emperor, the empress of your universe, and people are going to try to steal your power. You got to know how to maintain and protect it. Boss energy, right? Vampires are out there, babe. <laughs> Watch their ass. Anyways, I love you. God loves you. And the universe is crazy about you. So love yourself and get in your power, baby. Okay, bye. And I'm out.